Hello, this is Bree from Two Travelling Planners and uh, welcome to a Plane With Me video. And now this is the first one we've done, so bear with us and let's have a bit of fun. So using the classic Happy Planner uh, with the vertical layout, now we have taken out the pages that we're going to look at today. So we're looking at mid-October, so for us here in Australia that means spring, um, it's not the fall season for us. Uh, unfortunately, as that is my one, well, probably my favourite time of year. But um, this weekend or this weekend coming, it's going to be a birthday party in our household, and we're going with uh, Halloween theme. So we're going to use that to link back to our layout for the week, a couple of weeks early, but that's all right. So what we've got is we're going to go through a couple of the different sticker books, starting off with um, this one's I think from about a year or so old. And we've got the Halloween stickers out. Now when I'm setting up my layout, I do look at what I've got on, whether I've got meetings and things like that. Normally I do have that listed on a bit of paper. I'm flicking back with my phone. But uh, for now, we'll generally have a rough idea of what we're doing. So given that Saturday is our party week or our party day, I might just pop this. Oh, now these stickers are actually a bit smaller. So we might uh, break that up a little bit. I'm just pop that one down into there. Now I do work Monday to Friday, so we tend to find that some of the days are a little bit um, don't get as much filled into it. Now I found this little Halloween sticker um, or Halloween party sticker, so I'm just going to grab a little uh, party or a little box here from the colourful boxes, and I'm going to pop that in to match up with what we've missed out down here. Might overlap it a little. Now, apologies if there are, is any background noise. It is a Sunday afternoon. It's a beautiful sunny day and there is a bit of trade work being done outside. So that's given us a little bit there for Saturday's party. So we might fill out the rest of the week. Again, we're going to stick with the Halloween theme throughout most of this week's layout. So let's go for a bit of spider fun. Um, what else have we got? Now some of these I do want to hold off until Halloween itself. So we'll just see what we can fit in. What else have we got here? Um, Alright, what can we pick from somewhere else? Maybe, what's this book? Um, memory Keeping. So this is the big, the big stickers. So it is a little bit, they're a little bit big for the layout, but that's okay. Because so what we're going to do instead is just turn them around. Actually, that fits there, leaving a bit of that green line. Hmm. Don't particularly like that where it overlaps there. So we might just see if we can pull this back up a little. Just change that overlapping aspect of it. Alright, so that lifts up there, and we're just going to overlap that orange back over to the green, so that fits in nicely there. Okay, let's fill in a couple more of these little boxes. So we know that on, for us, on Tuesday night, we actually have um, swimming trials or a preliminary swim for our daughter's nipper session for the season. So we'll top up that one there. Maybe a little pumpkin sticker. Because why not? Okay. What else have we got that we can pop in here? Yeah, we've got a nice big spooky. Well, don't want it to pour out. So let's just... We might just overlap that over here a little. that all down. Alright. What else can we put in here? Oh, here we go. Let's go. Maybe a nice little ghost. Popping up the top. Now we might, we'll cut the, uh, punch that little part out afterwards. So that'll be fine. Alright. So just to fill in maybe a couple more of these little boxes here. There's a few more stickers that we've got in there. 
some of these they do tend to be very fall related when the two Halloween um, and the season mixes but that's all right we can grab a few little pumpkins which again to me is probably more fall but never mind put that into there um, let's just visualize a couple of these little stickers So these stickers are all utilised or utilising all of the Happy Planner stickers. Um, I do find that these books are just very easy and convenient. Um, not having to go hunting, okay, go hunting through different books, but you've got everything that you pr pretty much need. Maybe just there, fill in the gaps into that in a little bit. Um, let's see, Monday night and Tuesday night I've got out. Um, let's fill in maybe a few little gaps in here. A few little, little pumpkins. Because as much as pumpkins do mean or represent fall, uh, to me they really do also um, equate to Halloween as well. Alright, um, what else can we pop into here? Um, what can we find? So we're just flicking through the book again. And where was the other ones? Oh, well, let's maybe do, do, do that one thing. We'll use that one. Pop a little box in over the top of that anyway. Yeah, not sure I like that one just there, so we'll pull that one back out, I think. Um, I know what we'll do. We'll pop that down the bottom. Oh, not quite lined up, but that's okay. And we'll just go back to the, the colourful boxes page. And we'll just pop a little box into here. Okay, so we've popped in the little box just in here. Um, again, probably not sure I do love that one, but I'm sure as the week goes, we can work something out. And as the week gets filled up, then it changes the way it looks anyway. Um, let's see, maybe we can use this little black cat. So some of these stickers I've had now for a little while as I've been trying to work on what to use them for. So I do tend to save them and pop them aside. See, sometimes just putting a little sticker makes it changes the way it looks a little bit and how you feel about your layout okay so for me this week's going to be all about cake baking so we might just utilize maybe a couple of these little important stickers again they're things that I'll probably normally would probably just throw away and not really use um, most of the stickers in these books that I, I do find to be quite handy um, but every now and again you kind of go yeah you know what that one's not quite me but that's okay. So I might pop that one there aside for the moment. Um, okay, I'll come back to this one. Now to me, parties generally equate to lollies as well as um, presents and things like that. So I might put a little, little lolly or sweet there. Got spooky. How about... Now these are a little bit harder to get through now. Again, we've got background noise, we've got kids at home, uh, it is the weekend, so sometimes it's, things just can't, can't be helped. So I'll just fill that one into, in here. Okay. So this is the Happy Year uh, sticker book. Um, again, one of those seasonal, has plenty of, inf plenty of stickers to cover off every season. Um, here's a couple of things I could probably use. Um, how about like this little noted uh, little ghost, a bit ghouly. So I might pop that up here. Maybe for the week, for the Saturday morning, that'll give me plenty of things I can tick off. 
because uh, Saturday mornings for us are quite too uh, netball uh, and swimming lessons so just a few things i'll need to try and work on how we balance that out this week so that we can actually get our birthday parties and things up and running now this colorful boxes book is looking a little bit uh well used so there's not a lot of stickers i've got left in it uh, that's pretty much actually utilized always um so at this stage i think i've got some plans for sunday afternoon so we might just pop a little sticker there I don't think it's quite confirmed yet, but that'll fit in there. And that's Monday, and I've got a meeting up into there as well. Okay, so that probably is the way I would set my week up to start with. A little bit of decorative. Um, I know I've got a meeting here. We've got swim practice or swim trials for our nipper season or life saving. Netball, seat, uh, netball training uh, Wednesday morning, which for me means coffee, um, catch up with my friends. Um, need to start working on birthday cakes, and that's really pretty much what's going to flow into Friday. Saturday is going to be decorating cakes, the house, and then the actual party itself. Um, so I might just throw in a few more little decorative bits and pieces into there. And then we're pretty much, pretty much all done for uh, this week. Now one of the things that I have done, I think it's under here somewhere, is because we are in party plan mode, I'm uh, just grabbing one of the half sheets and filled out with just a couple of little stickers. And this one I'm going to pop in the confirmed guest list, uh, the food that we're doing, my checklist, and make sure that everything's done. And I'll just sit that into uh, the weekly planner, so we might just sit that in there now as well. So one of the great things about the Happy Planner is that we can just click in the pages uh, from, or click them in and out. So there's uh, one there. And then, so that's how this week will go. And then we'll just grab the pen later on, start to fill it all out, add bits and pieces as the week goes. And in goes the half page. Beautiful. Um, so again, it's so pretty much just using my classic vertical happy planner um, and the sticker books that do come from Mambi and Happy Planner. Again, convenient, they're easy. We do have a few Australian stockists um, here, otherwise shipping from the US is pretty quick. A little expensive, but that's not to be, uh, or that is to be expected, I, I guess. Um, you can always find us on Instagram and Facebook, which is Two Travelling Planners, and... If you like it, we'll keep trying these uh, Plan With Me's each week. I'll get better and we'll uh, hopefully eliminate some of the background noise. Anyway, um, please hit the subscribe button. Find us on Facebook and Instagram. We'll put the links up and have a lovely afternoon. See you.